Yeah, I was RDLing with the bar shit. 3.15, I was doing 125s for reps with uh, stiff legs. So I am super sore. So I wanted to go so ham and so heavy and some step back lunges, but I don't know. I got to be careful with the hamstrings. So I'm going to go light. I'm going to do a lot of reps, uh, which, you know, as some of you know, whenever I say I go light, I just usually go heavier than I normally do. So a light day usually turns into a heavy day. It depends on how I feel, but I'm going to go absolutely nuts. I am about to freak out. I might even like up the pre-workout a little bit. I'm going to be absolutely insane. So right now I'm actually holding it together. I really want to just like rip my scalp off because this beta alanine is just tearing my forehead apart. Um, yeah, I can't really hold it anymore. Oh, oh my God. Let's get it on. Let's get it on. Let's get it on. I'm gonna work out. I'm gonna work out. People are looking at me, but I don't care. That's what happens when you have 900 milligrams of caffeine. <laughs> Welcome to another edition of I would rather punch myself in the dick with brass knuckles than do cardio. I fucking hate cardio. Fucking hate it. That's right, fellas. It's your boy, Heli, and I'm here with my good brother, Tainaka. Tainaka, say hi to all the nice people watching Swole Normous Workout. Hey. I happy to see you too. Like get hip fox wall. Like uh, step back lunges here. Now that's right. The Swole Normers is doing some step back lunges with the 185 pounds, and that's a lot of weight for that boy. And now he's stepping up to deuce in the quarter. That's 245s on your side. That's 225. And uh, Tanaka, why don't you go over his form here a little bit, make sure the folks know how to do this properly if they try it on their own. Hey, make sure a knee stay behind the toe. Hey, the head straight, uh, engage core. The stomach, always engaged. Hey, oh, and uh, drive through heel and squeeze glute. That's right, Tainaka. You always want to squeeze them glutes and make sure that Tyransverse Abdominus is nice and engaged, sucking that stomach in, bracing all tight and shit. Well, where did where young where did he go over? There? Oh, all right. Now let's see what he's up to. Now. Okay, all right. I'm not sure what the heck's going on there. Always doing something weird with his hands, this guy. Um, all right, getting his. Man, is he going to do this set today or what? Maybe we should come back next week, Tainaka. What do you think? I take a long time. Very, very superstitious. Or oh, just uh, lazy and want to take extra rest. Well, I don't know about laziness because right now he's got 225 and he's doing yet another set of them step back lunges. Now, that is no small feat. That's some serious weight there, T Bone. Hey, 225 uh, hip fox wall is very, very heavy weight. Uh, chest up, uh, stomach in, uh, squeeze glute, uh, glute uh, hip extension. That's right, the glutes. Look, every time I come on to talk, this guy's taking a rest. He's not even doing arm day, he's moving his arm. What in the world is he doing? Oh, there he goes, getting them Sour Patch Kids. Yeah, well, he sure likes to get his little glucose pump during the workout. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him all sucking on them sour, sour little tarts right there. Hey, hey he's talking all the time. This guy ever work out? Yeah, miracle. Uh, he has muscle. He lazy, lazy little man. Well, uh, there again you go, t -Naka. You know, get a little jump in the gun on this boy's personality. Maybe he's just socializing locally, you know, giving some of the other folks a little helping hand with their form. You know, he tends to do that. Swole Norris is a very nice, approachable guy. Hey, approach, yes. Uh, but too long a rest period uh, for hypertrophy. So Norris all talk swole, but rest too long. 
well, you're one tough cookie, T-Bone, because, you know, we were just over here, and you were, you know, praising him for his form. And now you're getting on, saying, you know what, let's, let's just move on, and let's just let bygones be bygones. Now, over here, we got a, you know, these front squats. He's got some good shoulder flexion going on. And look, he's got this partial range of motion doing. He's getting a little pump in them glutes. What do you think about there, Bobak? Bobak, hey, you just walked in the door. You remember our Scottish friend, Bobak? Come on over here. Hey, remember me? <laughs> just got back from eating some bacon. <laughs> you know me, I love to pour. <laughs> Yeah, well, right now, Bobak, we ain't pork and we're doing squats, so don't start that shit again, all right? Damn. Hey, no porking this video. You promised we let you back. No pork. All right, I won't be porking today. <laughs> Maybe later they'll take my number down. <laughs> five, 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 pork. <laughs> all right, now, though, <laughs> to be serious. He's doing some squats. He's getting the stink eye from the guy in the back. Yeah, you know what? I noticed that. He's been eyeballing swole Normus's form the whole time. Well, you know what? They were nice fellas during the workout in between the scenes, and they're just miring, you know? It's, it's not unheard of in the gym. It's actually a form of flattery, so I don't think the swole Normus takes offense. Hey, no offense. He's a very nice thing to stare at someone's rump during workout. He's looking at his bum. Well, he's probably looking at his glutes because the glutes are the main muscle that provides hip extension there. And, you know, that's really what all these gym goers are focusing on for him and these kinesiology. They're probably also admiring his hamstrings, which are synergistic in the hip extension there. What you think about that, Bob? Look at his form. You think his hamstrings are activating? You think he's synergistically dominant? I don't know about that. Well, you're getting all crazy with the terms. <laughs> this isn't a history lesson. I am looking at him thinking about what he's thinking about. Guess what he's thinking about. <laughs> to pork, he's thinking I want to pork, I want bacon. <laughs> Holy Jiminy Crickets, Jeepers Creepers, Bob, enough with the porking, or you ain't gonna come back here for another video. I know Tanaka's about up to his little Japanese eyeballs with your pork. Another workout in the books. Hey, no pork. Uh, last time, final warming, Babak. Um, ah, look at us, we're missing the whole shebang. So let's, you know what? Let's pause this and rewind and let's see what the Swan Orms has to say. Could be important. All right, time out. So another workout in the books. I really felt good on my, my squats. Um, at the end, when I started doing some really deep squats and pulses. I pushed a lot. I think I'm a little dehydrated. I felt, I don't know if I felt a twinge in my hamstring, but I felt a little, I don't know, uncertainty. Maybe a little, like a little spasm. So I just cut it. You know, never push yourself too hard. Uh, I, I lied. You know, push yourself to the fucking limit. Push yourself over the edge, but don't listen to your body. So if you feel like a little quiver, you feel a little uncertainty, live to fight another day. Don't risk it. I can't wait to get some bacon. <sighs> All right, walking back to my car again after another great workout. Legs, the quads and glutes. I'm fucking fried, I can't wait to get some bacon. Again, thank you so much for joining me. I really do appreciate the support. The last video was, blew shit off the, the lid off this motherfucker, just like Tanaka said. So not gonna stop, gonna keep on showing you some cool stuff. Hope you like it. Q and A session a little bit later. Uh, this is gonna be posted after that, but check out my, uh, the Bacon Matters, that's going to be a Q&A uh, type setting where I sit down, I fucking eat bacon, and we talk and I answer all your questions. So DM me, message me on YouTube, send me an email at swollenormous at gmail, Facebook, however you want to get in touch with me, do so. And also my DWG, Driving While Gaining, that's going to be a cool series where it's pretty much a diary, just whatever's on my mind at the time. All right, talk to you later, and uh, let's get some bacon. Bye. <laughs> it's Bobak. Thank you for letting me join and talk about bacon and porking. Aye, <laughs> no more porking. We talked about this already.
Istanaka. See you next time. Hey. And last but not least, it's your boy Hila, and we'll see y'all next time when we get a big old swole enormous pump. If you like pina coladas and getting caught in the rain. When the night has come and the land is dark and the pre-workout starts itching my fucking scalp oh rip my hair out oh my god i'm gonna rage i'm gonna kill someone i'm gonna kill someone i'm gonna eat these glasses and i'm gonna fucking punch nails into my scalp don't try this at home oh, it hurts a little bit